So friends, welcome back to our channel Learn with Gigs. In today's video, I will tell you all four different strategies or four tips you can say to get the calls from Nokri.com. And I can assure you, once you do these four things that I will discuss now in couple of seconds, you will definitely be getting the interview calls. Hundred percent guaranteed, you will get the interview calls. I have applied these four strategies on myself. Plus, I have also told these to the other people who have been connected with me in the past. They also have got the calls using these strategies. Okay, so please watch the video completely because you will not find all these strategies or tips anywhere else on YouTube. Do let me know in the comment box how did you like this video. Okay, so let's start the video. And before that, if you are new to the channel, then do subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon to stay updated with all the coming useful videos. Okay, so the first thing that you have to do is. You have to log in into your Nokri.com profile. Since I have also logged in, so I am on my profile page. Okay. So what you have to do? First thing that you have to do is every day you have to open your profile either through your application in your mobile or on the web. Okay. So I have opened it on the web. What you have to do? You have to go to any of these section. Okay. Any of these section. Go to this edit button, and you don't have to do anything else. Just click on this, edit something. Okay, and then just click on save. Okay. Once you have saved it, when you will go up, it will show you last updated today. Okay, last updated today. So this means that you have been very active on Nokri.com. You are actively looking for a job, or you are actively looking for a switch. Okay, so this is very important. You have to do this every day. Okay, this creates a positive impression on the recruiter's mind because. They see that this person is quite active. They will not prefer the people who have been non-active on Nokri or who has not updated their anything on their profile in couple of days. So since you are active, so your chances of getting the call will be higher. So this is the first tip. Now moving on to the next tip. For that, what you have to do, you have to go to the job section. Okay. So in the job section, it will show you all the all the recommended jobs as per your profile. Whatever skills that you have mentioned there, Nokri dot com will show you the relevant jobs for you. Okay, so what you have to do here, see, automatically you will get the calls. That is a different way. But from your side also, you have to put some effort to get the interview calls fast. Okay, so what you have to do from your end is this is the next step. Go to the job where you will find some uh, some information about the recruiter who has posted the jobs. Okay, so for example, if I go to this, okay, click developer. a uh, technomatic company okay so see this company has even not put its logo also so just by seeing the job also you can uh, feel that this job is fraud or not okay you will not find anywhere uh, the mail id of the recruiter also if you can see here nothing nowhere it is mentioned who has posted this job so that if you can if you want you can connect with that person directly also nothing nowhere it is mentioned no logo so don't don't apply in these jobs instead of this what you have to do You have to go and filter out all those jobs. For example, if I take you this uh, this uh, position for Power BI Plus Visualization Zorient, okay. So if I click here, okay, what you will see here, see, see. <clears throat> if you can see here, all the uh, notice period, job requirement, roles and responsibilities, they have mentioned it here. But they have also mentioned the email ID of the recruiter, okay, the the one who has posted this job. Okay, see, you can easily get Sarita dot Shah at the rate Zorian dot com. Even the mobile number is also there. So you have to filter out these kind of jobs from where you can find the mail ID or the information about the recruiter. So once you get the recruiter's information, first of all, you have to apply. That is the normal way. You have to apply first, and then at the same time, you have to go to the. Uh, you have to send your resume to this mail ID also. So in this way. you are applying also plus at the same time you are connecting with that uh, uh, hr or recruiter directly through a mail or through the number and telling that you have applied for this position and you are actively looking for the job if my profile is suitable as per the requirement then do let me know i am eager to join your company so you have to filter out these kind of jobs and apply individually plus send the resume okay and also you have to keep this thing in your mind that don't go beyond 7 days See, this job was posted five days ago. So, if if any job is posted seven days ago or beyond, like eight days, nine days, ten days, then don't apply to those jobs because they are not fresh jobs. Okay, many people would have already applied to those job, and and there might be a possibility that th those vacancies have been filled. Okay, so always see if it is less than seven days. So this was the uh, next tip. That is the second tip. I hope it is clear to you now. 
what all things you have to do in this thing now moving on to the third thing okay so the third thing that you have to do is again go back to your profile okay so i will click on my profile view my updated profile so here what you have to do here you have to go to the edit section of your bio okay and here don't think about what i have mentioned it here because i have not updated nokri from couple of months because i am not not looking out so this is the old one but what you have to do is exactly is this in the notice period section you have to mention it two months or less than two months so if people who have notice period three months then do it is for those people they have to specifically mention it to two months if you will not mention it to two months then they will not give you the interview calls whatever you will do on nokri nothing will happen you won't get the interview calls so if you have notice period three months then on nokri you have to mention it as two months okay i hope it is clear to you now 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 once you get the call once you have cleared your interview your interview goes very good then what you can do is you can explain that i am negotiating with my manager and most probably you will get the early release so you can explain after you have cleared your all the interview technical rounds you can explain this point to the hr okay and more than 90% of the times they will wait for you okay they will wait for you and this i can tell you because i have seen people doing this and ultimately getting their job okay so this is the third thing that you have to do okay now the fourth thing that you have to do is again go back to your profile okay i will cancel it and what you have to do in the key skills section you have to mention all the relevant keywords with which the recruiter can look for you okay so if you can see here on the screen in the key skills i have mentioned since i am related to data analytics domain and my primary skill is power bi so i have written business intelligence mysql data warehousing power bi data visualization dax power query data modeling reporting t sql python uh, is azure analysis services azure data factory dax studio tab the editor so all the relevant things with which the recruiter can search for you you should mention it here and you have to do this thing to every section wherever it is possible so you have mentioned these in key skills in the employment section also okay in the employment section also in the it skills also everywhere in the projects also everywhere in the profile summary also wherever it is possible you mention all the relevant like include those keywords somehow okay for example if some recruiter is looking for data modeler so they will type data modeler okay so, so if somewhere if you have written data modeling if in in your resume if, if you have written data modeling then your resume will rank okay if you have not mentioned then your resume will not rank and ultimately will not get the interview call so i hope it is clear to you now that you have to use all the relevant keywords which is related to your profile and thus there is highly chances that you will get the interview call so these are the four things that you have to keep in your mind these are the four strategies and if you apply all these four strategies definitely you will get the call within a week okay within a week you will get the interview call okay so that is what i wanted to share with you all i hope it is clear to you now so thanks for watching this video and please do share the video to all your friends and colleagues whoever are in need of this